Well, Happy New Year, everybody. It is January 1st, 2024 today, and we are going to finish off a December budget, just the entries today, and maybe tomorrow or sometime other than today, I will do my net worth and all of the other fun stuff that I like to do at the end of the month, and especially important at the end of the year, or in this case, at the very beginning of the year. So here we go. First, I'm just going to take this out because I'm doing every day in December will be done after this. And so for any income, I received $100 for child support and another $100. Those were on separate weeks. I got paid in the same week, but they were four separate weeks. So I put them down as separate entries. And we go down... YMCA fees was 73.45. Not do any therapy this month. Took off December, but I will be resuming it next month. And gymnastics has I will put in there 67. 80 every month is gymnastics. Okay. And it's not a ton luckily for me. For this week since it is christmas so we weren't really out shopping or doing too much so groceries this month was 126.87 not month week rather was 126 dollars 87 cents so i'll add that to the 357.32 and that equals 484.19 And I, the kid was relatively cheap this month, so or this week rather. He didn't require any money from me, probably because he was using Christmas money to spend instead of mine. So that's kind of nice. Um, Justin's had a payment of seventy oh five. That is dog food, and that's. It for expenses. I paid off another fifty dollars on my credit card, bringing the total to two hundred for this month. Um, and put twenty more into savings, which was sixty. And that is not right because I have um, 575 plus 60. So 635. Is that right? Uh, this needs to be changed because I have deposited money into there. I just haven't calculated how much. So I will change that. But um, it should be a roughly around any one of these numbers. It's usually around 575. So, but I'm going to go back and change it. But other than that, that's all the expenses that were in December. So, this one is our automatically added up. Um, my income was 2635, pretty much the same as last month. Expenses was a little bit less. I did not have any therapy this month, so that's why that is less. My variable expenses, so we'll just add it up. So basically, you just highlight what you want added to the row above because the number is going to print there and just sum it up. And expenses were lower than usual, which is awesome, especially during Christmas. But I did do a lot of shopping in November and tried to do less in December, so that's kind of showing there. And yeah not bad and i said in a future video that sometime this week i'm gonna do my net worth and all this and i'll do my goals what i want to have my financial goals and everything like that so but that is december and i'm looking forward to getting into 2024 because my about my sheet is much nicer looking as you can see it's organized color-coded it's ready to go for January's input 
And uh, yeah, well, thanks for joining me on this budgeting for the end of December 2023. And good luck to everybody in 2024. And yeah, set some financial goals, some personal goals. Who cares if it's cliche to set it at New Year's? I find New Year's to be a good time for a good old fashioned reset. And I'm doing a lot this year and I will share that with you in future videos. So thanks for watching and I'll see you tomorrow.